And also Food Share is really helping to make sure that families are staying fed, specifically in uh, Hartford and Tallinn counties during what really can be a time of crisis. Fox 61's Ashley Afonso shows us how uh, groceries were provided for all of those families a little bit earlier today. Food Share had one of its pickup locations in Hartford this morning and within minutes of the truck arriving already, there were dozens of people in line and Food Share expects that need for food to only grow in the coming weeks. And as you can see here, just by the fact that there's people congregated on what's uh, at least a little snowy or a cold um, Monday morning, uh, there's still a tremendous amount of need out there. Within minutes of the food share truck pulling up to the park on Orange Street this morning, dozens of people were in line with their bags to receive groceries from food share's mobile pantry. A sign of the hard times many are currently facing. The governor and I are concerned uh, that we will need more food going forward. 72,000 people last week applied for unemployment, so we know that there's going to be uh, a significant need out there. The Lieutenant Governor joined Food Share volunteers to help pass out this food. Food Share taking all the help they can get as they expect to be even busier in the months to come. One of the things that we know from these types of things in food banking is that the, the issue will linger, especially in a situation like this where there is such an economic impact, um, a, a, what we expect to be a longer term economic impact. The Lieutenant Governor along with Food Share asking anyone who can get involved to please do so. We're asking people to do two things. Uh, one, uh, make a donation to Food Bank or um, the Connecticut Food Bank or Connecticut Food Share. Uh, or if you are able to volunteer, uh, contact those organizations and volunteer. Food Share has dozens of these mobile food pickup sites throughout the state on varying days. For a full list of those sites, head to our website, fox61.com. In Hartford, Ashley Afonso, Fox 61 News.